two memories were lost on our last trip, one due to my uh, lack of attention to detail, and another due to Obsession's Gaze being a pretty punishing chapter. I think uh, I think we're gonna go for uh, we're gonna continue the cycling. We're gonna go for denial here, and my my plan at the moment is I want to get some like real proper juggle comp action going. We've uh, hey mutant bread, welcome to stream. Uh, hey Constantine, welcome, welcome, welcome everybody. We. Uh, we need to get some real juggle comp going, I feel like. It, it feels like now is the time. Yeah, the holiday was delightful. So, yes, sadly, our, uh, our grave robber does not have... Uh, does not have much going on here. And uh, sadly, our leper is also unnamed. So we're going to have to come up with a plan. But right now... I'm feeling. What do we got for quirks here? Thick-blooded and bad digestion isn't gonna isn't gonna move the needle much. But I'm kind of kind of digging some night sworn action. Thinking dismiss can come in, although dismiss being a rogue continues to be uh, continues to be problematic. And then Rusty is probably our best our best mobile tank. And then probably Doctor Strange. I think this might be uh, this might be the crew. We could we could try doing something with uh, lightning reflexes. Is nice. Could do something with an arsonist also. Is plus 40 damage for the orphan worth occasionally being up front? The fact that Firestarter gives the orphan. The uh, the crit token was deeply frustrating for me, but we might be able to make this work. This is a high goal reward uh, reward option here, but I'm gonna I want to get some lunging and pirouetting in. Dismiss has a pretty negative, a pretty big downside as we shift them backwards. So we're gonna to want to try to be shifting them forward. I don't know. Let's let's give this a go. I think this will be uh, this will be interesting. Now let's make sure that we have a night sworn here, and we do need something here. Less damage, more burn. The turn start burn on arsonist is really really uh, difficult to work around. Let's go. Let's go survivor. We haven't played with survivor in a while. All right, let's get this uh, let's get this party started. And if uh, if anyone has any name suggestions, we have a grave robber who we are going to be giving memories to, and a uh, and a runaway. When you are ready, this roadway so un unfortunately, Constantine, the uh, the the gra as much as Dismiss looks like they aren't. <laughs> because no one named them the first time around, we do have memories on them. So it is, uh, it is Bonnie and Audrey that are, uh, that are getting names, if anyone is, is so inclined. Wow, the, the town is looking extra snazzy at the moment. The more they have to hold on to. So let's see, Rusty Rusty's at full power here. Hmm. So we have favorite toy, which I am a huge fan of. I think promise kept. I'm probably gonna put on Dismas. A fleeting impression. And then favorite toy. Hmm. I think this this version of Audrey doesn't benefit that much from favorite toy, so I'll put it here. Grave Robber's Widow, you got it. So we'll put Favorite Toy here for a little more burn, even though we're not going to be too effectively burning. And then I don't love any of these, but I do want to keep Audrey around. So let's put the Disease Resist there, and we will put, put Stun Resist on Rusty. 
Oh, we can we can keep going too if we want. Now nah, we'll we'll hold off. Excess candles have been deposited into the pool of reflection. I don't I don't know exactly what that means. At some point, we'll uh, we'll probably learn. All right, we'll go. We'll go Black Widow for uh, for our new lunging pirouetting grave robber. Speaking of which, we uh, we probably should actually get that set up. We'll go Dead of Night, and then we're gonna keep Poison Dart. Actually, hold on. We're gonna go Lunge Pirouette, Dead of Night, Poison Dart, and I guess Shadow Fade. We may actually need to Shadow Fade with this character to get uh, to get the Night Sworn working. Given that Shadow Fade gives two, kind of wonder if we should just open with that. We could put her here. It, that may be too slow for a lot of fights, but I guess we can we can always pirouette. Oh wow, smoke bombs pre hoarder. Is it my birthday? Oh yeah, and then Bonnie. You're gonna you're gonna be doing some of this, some of this. We want those, and then we want that. Oh yeah, wait. Are those not uh not happening? That's I I completely forgot about the uh, the cosmetics. I guess. I guess those just. I, I haven't been spending on those. I completely forgot. What is, what is the pool of reflection? Is it automatic? But is it automatically? Uh, I guess it's automatically spending them there since that's the only place to spend them. Okay, we'll take a we'll take a look shortly here. Oh boy. Nothing interesting there. Songbook of Amor's Ballad seems like more of a trap than not. Uh, I think we're I think we're saving our money here. There there is not a thing here that I think is worth picking up. All right. All right. We'll we'll check it out. We will check it out. So it unlocks so that everything is maxed out. So that means we we have all of the uh, we have all the skins, or do the skins come from a from a separate section as well? Oh, skins are all unlocked. Okay, then yeah, we'll pretty up the stagecoach. Interesting setup we got here. I don't know that uh, that is exactly what I want Rusty to have, but we'll find out. If not, we will definitely spend our future uh, our future goodie on goodies on upgrading and getting some skins for the stage coach. If I'm being perfectly honest, I completely forgot that uh, that that was a thing. <laughs> so, go figure, right? Let's see. I think Black Widow having these. Actually, it's probably good. Oh, hello. We got too much stuff going on in the background. I'll wait and do it now. No, no, the Bay Area is pretty much uh, snow free, but uh, my my family is. Uh, some of my family are out there in the uh, in the greater area now because we're doing a. We're probably going to use the Infernal Torch because we're we're doing a. We're doing a chapter one run. Trying to decide where we put our... What do, what do you get for Shadow Fade upgraded? Get a speed token. Hmm. Not sure I care too much about that. Where, where are we headed right now? Oh. Heatwave and the Sprawl is a little rough. 
I think we're probably going to go to the Tangle. Trenches and tents. We may have to do a little bit of uh, of manipulation to get the to get things sorted. We could also bring in the Bounty Hunter. Uh, we haven't done we haven't brought in the Bounty Hunter in a while. That could be fun. Going to grab Bolster. I think I'm going to grab Bolster and Retribution and call it a day. But yeah, let's uh let's let's hire the bounty hunter. Bonnie will be here when we get back. The thrill of the hunt. The promise of payment. We have we have him fully unlocked now, so if we're gonna I think we're gonna be going kinda back line here. So I'll probably grab Hurlbat, finish him. God, no escape is pretty is pretty spicy, if I do say so myself. Uh, uppercut and stare down probably eh, maybe 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 come hither and then like I said I think it's uh I think we'll we'll go for for a little darkness run and since this is region one we can probably get away with Ah, eh, we'll, we'll spend it. We'll we'll get everybody chonked up, as it were. And then, for now, we'll give you those. He, I, the fact that the bounty hunter can pretty much only get their trinkets from from there is a little from from them coming in with them is a little frustrating. But let's uh, let's get out there, get rocking and or rolling. Are we going to get punished with any relationships? We are relationship free. God, I love I love the art on this. Uh, I'm going to try and figure out a way to make my thumbnail the uh, this this kind of scene that is appropriate to the region that we're going into. I think that would be pretty cool. Uh, but I'm going to need to going to have to tweak some things to get that there. But I think it would be fun for the party to be reflected in the thumbnail. So, I'm seeing if I can make that happen. Oh yeah, and then Rusty's got some weird skills at the moment. So we will... We don't need... I don't think we need command right now. Strategic withdrawal might be useful. Okay, looks... Looks like, uh, looks like a short one here. I guess let's go to the creature den right off. Yeah, Constantine. I, I don't know if the if the entirety of the Pitch Black Dungeon videos are uh, are worth a watch, but it uh, it certainly was a was a fun series, and the end is pretty exciting, if I uh, if I do say so myself. But it you know it's it's a long it's a long series, a lot a uh, lot going on. Ooh, start out with uh, start out with a stealth. I'd like to get. Rusty's relationships going, but the uh, starting out with a blind isn't that useful. But let's do it this way to try and save a little bit of pain. We are uh, we are lacking some things. All right, it's gonna be okay. It's a good start. Close, but no cigar. Rusty with that evasive, though, is uh, nothing to complain about. It's crazy having a stun right off the cuff. We don't have a great capacity for clearing corpses, I don't... It doesn't seem... We'll have to... We'll have to see about that one.
Wouldn't mind the crit giving us a bit of stress healing for sure. Let's see. I'm trying to decide if... I don't really want to finish the fight right now. I'd rather I'd rather finish it right at the beginning of a round so we get that that free action. Yeah, this works out reasonably well. I mean, we might as well try for the no escape. That was beautiful. Does that ignore dodge? Ignores dodge. Holy smokes, that's a that's an exciting one that I was unaware of. Oh, we get a relationship pip here, so I will I will refresh the defender. Gotta love the dodges. Good hit there, though. I'm actually quite quite surprised by that. No escape has a long cooldown, though, for sure. <laughs> the spiders bug you, Constantine. Sounds about right. Just not bothered. Rusty is a uh, Rusty is a monster. Never, never doubt it. Now this is where we're getting into some trouble. We probably we probably need to have duelist advance on uh, on our highwayman. Oh, we can hurl bat here. Wow! All right, bounty hunter's doing some work. Don't like her taking that hit. Mm, resisting the blight though is uh, is good for business. Definitely. Definitely feeling like we need we need to do a bit more there, but This is this is one thing that I, I don't love. Is we definitely we definitely have to check all of our options with uh with Rusty to know. But Bounty Hunter is carrying at the moment, which is its own kind of worry, because the Bounty Hunter is not a permanent member of our team. The awaits, eager to fly his well, a Say Gear is nice. That's a, that's a good pickup, especially this early in a run. Did we get the bonus mastery there? We did not. Now let's see. I think we do have to change up your skills. The melee thing is not, not working. Yeah, I think we need something more like this. Uh, double cross doesn't need to be in the mix, so we'll go with that. And then we already have some here. Our trinkets are non-existent. We are we are rich, but we need to uh, we need to parlay that into something. I fear I fear, uh, or all of our riches will do nothing. I think there's a there's a good. There's a good line from the... Is it from the original or is it from this one? I guess it's, yeah, all the wealth in the world is meaningless. Something, something. Oh, this is brutal. Do we take the break even on relationship and skip the fight? I 
I'm I'm gonna do this. I, I want the fight. I wanna get our wealth is worthless without purpose. There we go, mutant bread. I'm glad someone is paying attention. It's definitely not me. Oh, expected expected the kill there. A little disappointed. No escape is insane, though. See, this is one of those situations where I would be very excited to run this team as a as a full time team, but the the fact that we're gonna see the uh, we're going to see the bounty hunter leaving. Feels bad. Why are you... What are you applying combo because of? Or is that just... That's well, not a part of the rogue. That's interesting. Actually, we have we have a goal to dead of night three corpses. So I'm I'm just gonna do that because <laughs> I think we we have the time. Ain't no rest for the wicked. That is a that is a true statement. Oh, the bounty hunters' animations are just beautiful. Goal achieved. I don't know if it was worth it, <laughs> but we did it. We don't really need the candles. Messy. All right, Rusty is, is in the cranky zone. All right, no mastery makes me feel a bit like I, uh, I was sold a false bill of goods. But, but we do what we can. Now, we are... This is not going to be an easy general kill, but I think we still do it. Oh, man, we're really... The route planning on this run so far has been a little... Uh, a little difficult to get around. Now, for this one, you're going to need Bellow... And I might drop Dead of Night. I think this is probably all correct. Yes, Bellow helps with the general because it's one additional way to push back the tap root, which we are going to struggle quite a bit with. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna have a hard time keeping the tap root pushed back with this team without wasting a lot of actions. So Bellow is good because it means that every other turn Rusty is going to be able to, or every third turn Rusty will be able to do to help a little bit out with the taproot. Because we don't have any AoE, so we're going to have a bit of a hard time. Resisting the stun is cool. Actually, oh, stun resist on... Stun resist would have been great on you. I wish I had thought of that sooner. <laughs> Forgot we got cowardice at the end of last run. Uh, I think we're going to take some hits here. Nice hit. Not not quite enough. A brilliant conclusion. Yeah. 
<laughs> yes, indeed, mutant bread. Yes, indeed. Let's see. I think we'll just do that. I love that the fact that the bounty hunter doesn't use up combo is quite pleasant. Yeah, cowardice on the leper is, is by far the worst. That one is just not to be trifled with. But yeah, I think we're gonna end up wasting some smoke bombs to push back the push back the Ooh, order volley. That's a little annoying. Where my where my crits at? Huh? I need I need some more. Alright, focus fire dodged is probably good. For the best, I would say. Slow this guy down a bit. Okay, well, if you're wondering about cowardice, it uh, it seems to proc every uh, every fight. Alright, it's gonna be a while before I can check the outrage. All right, that was annoying, but. Oh, and that was our last taunt, too, which means this guy, uh, well, he's going to penance, which is pretty, pretty kind to us. All right, we're not getting any benefit out of this, so I think we just move you forward. Some stress healing for Rusty would be, okay, completely impossible, I guess, is uh, the words that I was should have been using. Ooh, we are now, we are now in a danger zone. Wait, oh, force, wait, I can't use, uh-oh. We're going to get exploded on, I think, here. We are potentially going to get exploded on. This forced invalid is really, uh, really taking the wind out of my sails. I'm get, I'm preparing for next turn, but we, uh, we may end up. I think the repost may get the kill here, and we're also not going to get a lot of healing, which means we're going to be going in a little bit in the dangers. Oh, is it going? Oh, boo! All right, well. Footman, gr this is really not what we were looking for. This is pretty much as bad a collection of things as we could get. <sighs> eh, let's let's push our locks. Push our locks. Why is our luck plural? Locked in a nightmare slumber, he is tortured by failures both real and imagined. We got a long way to go. This is, this is going to be a nasty fight. Yeah, reverberating redoubt is uh, nowhere to be found, unfortunately. I don't like that that dodge still causes that. Um, this is where things get tricky, unfortunately.
Because we need to push back the... The growth here. I hate to do it, but I, I think we need to keep pushing. Uh, keep on pushing. Bravo. Wasting smoke bombs always feels bad, but... Still, the, the stress for the dodge doesn't doesn't fully click with me. Um, that certainly complicates things a little bit. Um, Crits would be would be much appreciated here. Now this is this is where we start to run into problems. So I'm gonna gonna save it. I am gonna throw that there to push back the last of the last of the nastiness. But like a bad Walking Dead here could really uh, sour things for us. What's the cooldown on bellow? Cooldown's one. Okay, so we can bellow this turn. So we're gonna we're gonna use our last smoke bomb to push back the fog, and then five to ten or two to four. I don't want to push back, uh, dismiss any further. We still have sixty-five to go, so we're not a. Uh, we're not cruising here. Not the hit we needed, but... A little worried about Dismas right now. We do, after all, have no healing. <laughs> a mere technicality, but, you know. I'm going to push back one of the growths, and that's going to be about all we get. Come on, no dodge? Missing out on the dodge there hurts a lot. Um... No, and wow, no, uh, no relationship for, uh, for putting that there. Um, so here's the thing. I think retribution is similarly protective. So I think we just go for this. Okay, that's bad. <laughs> that is very bad. Please re please remove this growth. Oh man. That's about as bad as it gets. Now we have to waste two actions here to unlock Rusty and then hope that we're not getting walking deaded back there. Yeah, walking dead. All right. Well, things are getting a little spicy, for sure. Oh, I hate this. Um, a six, we're doing four to seven here. Uh, 
No death door means we may take a death here, I think. Okay. Unsettling whispers means no death. Okay, well, for a bunch of trinkets we didn't want, and one mastery. <laughs> was it worth it? I would, I would wager a guess that it was not, but... We do have Daredevil, so this this will convert some, get us, give us some defense. We'll put the calibrating sensor here. Gain on miss. Yeah, here's one mastery. Don't spend it all in one place. Is right. I think Rusty's probably gonna have a meltdown anyways. I just. I just feel it in my bones. Oh boy. The stagecoach pips are pipping aggressively. Okay, can we pull back or are we uh, or are we doomed? Gonna light everybody on fire, I think. No escape is pretty sweet. <laughs> On to the next. Okay, so now our, our goal is to delay. Get some healing in, get some, do some delaying. The dodges, they do nothing. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> oh my word. Do that for the potential stress healing. How am I not getting any relationship positives here? This is really almost upsetting. You're gonna attack. I think we I think we go for another bolster here. Because I think we have the defense that we need. And I'm just going to get rid of this guy so we're not even taking the hit, potentially. Alright, well, I'm glad I didn't rely on that 5% death's door there. Okay, we get a full turn here, I think. We're not going to get anything else out of it. I think we're just done. I'm not I'm not going to fish for crits. Wow. Oh, these guys are unyielding. That explains it. All right. Well, I'm glad I I didn't dilly-dally too much, but Dismiss is uh seen seen some rough times. Let it die. Rusty's keeping us on an even keel, but that's uh and we're we're looking a lot better than we were looking before, I must say. Like we've we've recovered nicely from the general, which is uh its own special surprise. 
I want the relationship here. I see that unfriendly lurking there. That's unfortunate. A meditative totem. Maybe we can get rid of that. Uh, we got another... Wait, I used Dead of Night three times in a single fight game. I can go back and show you the footage. All right, this one is bugged, I guess. That's unfortunate. Ooh, a cultist fight? It's really not what I want to see, honestly. Oh, that was a beautiful voice line there. Okay, well, we're not getting anything out of it, so it doesn't really matter which way we go with that one. Uh, yeah. Well, I always take healing solves if they pop up, so... <laughs> yeah. Stack it on, game. Stack it on. Thank you, Dodge. Didn't know those still worked. Ooh, resisted the stun. Interesting. Seriously concerned about Dismas. I don't know if it beats the slow suffering one. That's a that's a hard that's a hard question to answer, Any. That one is so good. Alright, 50 50 here. I think we have to go for it. Uh oh my god. What is the percentage on cowardice? 15%? That's pretty high. Uh. Shouldn't have put that on the bounty hunter. I'm just, at this point, I'm just panicking. I forgot Pirouette's also on a cooldown. That's not ideal. Good hit there, though. Take that, I don't care. Oh my gosh, can someone just please leave Dismas alone for just a moment here? The game has a thing for ruining Dismas's day. I don't, I don't blame it, but... I think the best we can do here is bellow. We remove, we potentially slow them down, but mostly we remove. Still not enough. I guess I probably shouldn't have moved Dismas forward. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Can't catch a break here. At least it's not hitting Dismas. I really, anything is better than hitting Dismas, although that bleed could be the death of him. Uh, actually, it's looking pretty likely that it might be, because um, I don't have... I don't have any way to cure it at this point. Um, 8 to 14? All right. 
Dismas hanging on by a thread. Like, seriously hanging on by a thread. Any healing would be a welcome addition to our uh, our motley crew here. For now, I'll give you the damage trinket, and I guess we'll do that. A little, a little bit of driving for some road healing probably wouldn't be the worst idea. I, I feel terrible that we only have one mastery. We have more money than than we know what to do with. <sighs> I'm gonna I'm gonna give us a little bit of time to regenerate before this fight. Come on, Dismas. Pick up a pick up a little bit of, of healing. You're you're doing you're doing fine, but you and Black Widow, this is gonna push you into unfriendly. I don't think I can say no to stealth plus blind though. We need an easy fight. They be they be sturdy. Okay, seeing a little bit of stress healing feels uh, almost too kind. Getting a uh, getting pistol shot upgraded would be really nice because we have a decent amount of combo at the moment. If the Bounty Hunter takes some hits, I think it's okay. I just, I don't want Dismas taking any hits here. Having a hard time utilizing our, uh, our Night Sworn at present. beautiful. I feel like when an enemy hits into defender, if you have repost up, you should still uh, you should still retaliate. I think that would be a cool a cool little dynamic. Of course I do. Who who wouldn't? Anything that's going to give... No, it looks like we're not going to be able to fish any relationship out of this. I mean, the meltdown still isn't good, so I'll go ahead and do that. Yeah, I think... I'm really looking forward to mod support, because I think the bounty hunter, if you tune them down a little bit, they're just, they're just such a beautiful character. I want them to be... I want them to be full-time. Sir Farquad, welcome, welcome. Good to see you as always. Let's see, we haven't gone to the sluice yet, so I think we have enough other stress healing. The stitching kit might be good for Dismas, who Lord knows could use a little bit of something. And then we can put that there. We still have to get rid of two more. Look at our bankroll. Holy smokes. 
I don't think I care about the collector chandelier. We also don't need quite this many baubles since we're going to have the bauble. Uh, we're going to have the discount for the entire next region, so I'll, I'll lose some baubles. So I've had two characters go resolute so far, Sir Farquaad. One was in my first run. I had a bounty hunter that went uh, resolute, which is pretty cool. And then I think we had one in our last run. I mean, I'll take the supplies. And I will absolutely take some bandages. I'll hang on to the holy water too in exchange for the assay gear is quite nice. Eight relics, we're we're swimming in relics, so. Ooh, it's hard to throw away food right now. We have two things that were blocking the ability to use the stitching kits. Both Dismas, so Dismas couldn't use them. So I think it was worth doing. And now the question is for this first... For this first fight, I think we're better lunging into pirouetting than going directly for the pirouette. But we've uh, we've righted the, the good ship friendship a little bit. I guess we do have money, Constantine. That is that is a good point. Were these hastened enemies, or am I just getting absolutely rolled here? I think I'm just getting rolled here. The the roll on on timing was not great. I need to get rid of this knucklehead. Probably should hold off on that, but... Okay, that's perfect. That, that gets the kill there, which is good. Uh... I really need to put one of the Wicked Slices on the board. Oh, you're not dead. Well, that's pesky. That is pesky indeed. Well, I guess we don't have a choice. Let's just finish it off before, uh, before it causes too much trouble. Are you just getting sanguine procs like crazy, Dismas? You're uh, you're doing some good work, my friend. Fourteen damage. Not terrible. I don't really want to do the pull here, so I think the Hurlbat is the right decision. Uh, Tenebrae, I did it. I did it because I never do it. <laughs> there is, there is no more, uh, no more exciting reason than that. I just thought it would be fun. gonna keep her alive no oh, can't no escape there unfortunately
This is going to be a little messy, I fear. The, the dodges, they do nothing, unfortunately. I'm going to wait and save the bandage. Uh... Just because I, I fear we may need it. Great hit there. That was a that was a surprisingly good hit. That's amazing. That's that's a perfect perfect targeting there. Now imagine if we had had a survivor runaway to deal with these bleeds. Cough, cough. Um, <laughs> cowardice is really driving me up the wall and around the corner right now. Yeah, we need... Dismas needs something else that, that he can do from the front rank. Oh, I wouldn't mind getting a stress heal off now before we finish. Sadly, I don't think we're going to get it. Because I'm not going to take a beating that I don't need to. Well, at least we got the mastery for that. Ooh, sickening silence is fun. All right, we got to take everything and throw some stuff away. All right, Rusty, you have no disease right now, but we'll, we'll work on that for you, you <laughs> lucky duck. And then unfortunately, I think this is the best we can do. And then just for now, we'll put that on you. And... That'll get us... This will get us to the end of the region. And then we can clean things up. And our stress isn't looking too bad. Rusty's a little, a little cantankerous at the moment. Now we have two slime mold. We're going to have more money than we know what to do with, especially once the assay gear gets active. So I think I'm just going to keep keep the slime mold. Hey, Gordon, you did fine, but I wouldn't write home about your services. My Yelp review would be like, probably wouldn't come back, but it wasn't disgusting. Bonnie picks up the yips. Black Widow picks up hemophilia. Gee, thanks, game. All right, let's start with... I'd really love to burn off cowardice, but I don't know that I... I don't know that it is likely that that will happen. I mean, let's, let's do it here anyways, just because... Okay, it took a nothing, so go figure. Mop and bucket we're not going to end up using. Well, actually, hold on. We should we should check our route. Everywhere. Are we going sluiceward? All right. We'll uh, we'll be a little more cautious. Oh, and we also have Gaunt are going to be stronger coming into the next one. God, we need a hospital quite badly to go with the absolute mountain of stuff we have here. I'll do this though. Did you just pick something up? No. And because it's the sluice, oh. Because you are squeamish, we can't. Well, we want you to get a disease anyways, I guess. And since the food that we have is crummy, I'm gonna I'm gonna let it go. And now candles and chocolate. Let's look at our relationships at the moment. 
Bonnie's going to be behind on most things, I think. We have a 9 there. All right, I think we go for the 9. I think Rusty and Bonnie get it. Well, we could also take advantage of the stress healing. How are Black Widow and Rusty? Yeah, they're actually pretty good. So I think I value that more. They got the full three, which is nice. Do we roll the dice on the Songbook of Amorous Ballads? Sure, let's let's do it. Ooh, we got the good one. Nice. And I guess we just put those there and then mop and bucket I don't I don't mess with we'll go with those there and then you can take the smoke bomb we won't fill up 10 slots I don't think and four uh, four mastery doesn't feel terrible oh yeah what did we have for provisions we haven't even looked yet have we Jumbo storage trunk is probably a good pull here, even though it's full price. Yeah, I think this is a good investment in our future. And the wild tea is good too. Anything that lets us travel further is worth the cost. All right, that's gonna be that's gonna be my my buying frenzy, and then. Lightning Reflexes is nice. Thick-Blooded I really don't care about, but I don't really care about either of those either. Let's, uh, let's roll the dice with Lightning Reflexes. It only left the yips. Game, game, game. Okay, so mastery-wise, I think Pistol Shot is a good pickup. And Smokescreen is exceptionally good, so we'll pick that up. I think we're going to be using Poison Dart fairly frequently. So I'll grab that. And then I think I'm also going to grab Dead of Night. Just because the stress healing and stress control is so good on it. It's not great. We, uh, we need some more mastery, but we're going to go try and get some. Was there anything in the Provisioner for taking care of that last stress? Guess, I mean, for eight? I'll buy a Whittling Tools just to... Give us the best chance. And then Blasphemous Idol. I'm going to save it for next region. Cross your fingers. 